John Holworth, a German-Russian from the Crimea region, brought the dish with him when he immigrated to Hutchinson County in the 1870s. According to historical records, it is unclear why Holworth, and not the hundreds of other German-Russian immigrants, is credited with bringing chislik to South Dakota. The term chislik most likely derives from the Turkish word shazlik or shazlik. The Russian dish features cubes of skewered meat grilled over an open fire. The origin of the word shazlik is rooted in shish kebab, the Turkish and Arabic words for skewered meats. Once arriving to South Dakota, most became farmers. To celebrate their harvest, a group of farmers would slaughter their oldest sheep, also known as mutton. They would cube it, fry it, and share that dish with their fellow neighbors. Some historians say a town of Freeman in Hutchinson County is considered the Chislik capital of America. It is the center of what's sometimes called the Chislik Circle, an area that includes Sioux Falls, South Dakota. It wasn't until the 1930s that Chislik began to gain regional notoriety. It was unclear who started selling Chislik in Freeman first. Some locals say it was local entrepreneur Jake Huber. Reno Huber's distant relative was the first to sell Chislik. In the 1930s and 40s, Huber operated a Chislik stand on hot summer Saturday nights. Nearby farm families would come to town for shopping and socializing. Others argue that Albert Krieger deserves the credit for the Freeman Chislik tradition. Regardless of who started it, Freeman quickly entered a Chislik boom that spread to the surrounding communities. Chislik didn't officially hit the Sioux Falls scene until the winter of 1961. The newly opened Pit Club ran an advertisement in the January 27, 1961 Argus Leader, stating, The Pit offers the delicious Chislik, a newcomer to Sioux Falls. If you have never tried it, you're in for a treat. A recipe for Chislik under the Russian name Chaslik first appeared in the Argus Leader 12 years earlier, on February 27, 1949, in an article about Moscow nightlife. The article featured small pieces of lamb well done. Over time, regional differences developed for how to prepare and serve Chislik. It can be grilled, fried, skewered, eaten with toothpicks, marinated, salted, and more. In Freeman, South Dakota, Chislik is traditionally lamb cooked on a skewer. In Sioux Falls, it is more common to see the half-inch chunks of Chislik served in a basket with toothpicks as your utensil rather than on a stick. Chefs and consumers are less picky when it comes to the meat. Lamb is often substituted with beef or venison. Traditionally, lamb Chislik is fried, salted, and served with soda crackers. Some say it goes down well with a cold beer. Nowadays, Chislik is served in a variety of ways, including marinated and with special dipping sauces. In recognition of its long regional history and growing popularity, the South Dakota Legislature passed Senate Bill 96, designating Chislik the official state nosh, an old German word meaning snack. www.urbanchislik.com Like us on Facebook. Follow us on Pinterest, Twitter, and Instagram.